In this revised installment of my vintage jewelry collection, French-American old couture designer Pauline Chagira is featured. Miss Chagira was known for her beautiful pieces, expanding from custom dresses, suits, and coats to ready-to-wear. She dressed the famous as well as the everyday woman. By the 1950s, with her own fashion house established, she ventured into producing a line of costume jewelry and later a fragrance and bath products line. Her jewelry, stately yet elegant, included Asian and Aztec Mayan inspired and Diamante creations. According to the article, The Many Talents of Pauline Chagira, she fashioned barrettes, pins, and brooches out of a crystallized strontium titanate medium, and when properly cut, her Chagira diamonds looked real. And as you'll see, many of the pieces featured in this video look very much like real diamonds, from the Diamante tulip to the three star brooch. Diamante meaning something decorated or adorned with artificial jewels, in this case rhinestones. Turtle brooches became Pauline Trujera's signature pieces worn on the lapel of her jackets. For her, turtles symbolized longevity, sturdiness, and happiness. And over a period of time, I have collected some of these iconic turtles and other pieces from Trujera. First is the Sonix and Rhinestone Turtle, the largest in the collection. It measures 3 and 1 8 inch and is stamped with the oval Trujera cartouche on the underside of its head. Next is this clear rhinestone turtle with the Trujera cartouche on its belly, as will be the case with the remaining three turtles in this grouping. Each measures 2 and 3 8 inch except for the red and milkstone turtle, which measures 2 and 3 4 inch because its tail is broken off. The piece was sold as is, not just for this reason, but because the pen was bent. Next is this sky blue and rhinestone turtle with tight pen and cartouche. This is the navy and milkstone turtle, also with tight pen and cartouche. Now the red and milkstone turtle. The smallest turtles measure 1 and 7 eighths inch. The first, the emerald green and rhinestone, then the milkstone and rhinestone. Both turtles have a cartouche on the belly. These rare sunflower clip-on earrings, though a bit tarnished, fit well on the ears. One has a rectangle cartouche. This Diamante tulip measures 4 inches and is something to behold. The three wildflower brooch with that wow factor has pearl centers and measures two and three quarters inch by two and five eighths inch. This buttercup or dame's rocket brooch measures two inches by two inches.
This pair of wildflower clip-on earrings, which measure one and three-fourths inch each, can be worn with either the buttercup or wildflower brooch. I discovered there is also a matching hairpin. This gold hibiscus pendant measures two and a quarter by two and a quarter with a 14 inch chain. The back is finished in 14 karat brush gold. A weighty piece, I acquired the pendant from a seller based in Hawaii. While vacationing in Kona in 2017, I wore it and received lots of compliments. According to flowermeaning.com, a yellow species of hibiscus called Hawaiian hibiscus became Hawaii's official state flower in 1988 despite it not being native to the area. This is Hawaii's second official state flower. The first was the red hibiscus native to Hawaii. Hibiscuses come in a floral rainbow of colors, each with a particular meaning. This exquisite pair of wildflower teardrop clip-on earrings with peridot and rhinestone, measured two and a quarter by one and three quarter, are very reflective and faceted. This pair of onyx and rhinestone teardrop showstoppers measures two inches by one inch and are similar to a pair I purchased from Swanson's department store. This dazzling rhinestone fan with a large clear teardrop measures four inches by two and a quarter inches and looks fabulous on the lapel of a jacket. This 1950s pave ribbon bow measures three inches by two inches. Its cousin, the red rhinestone pave bow, is rare and highly sought after. The three star brooch measures three inches, while the two star brooch measures two and three fourths inch gifted to me when I acquired the onyx and rhinestone teardrop earrings. These lovelies measure one and a quarter inch by a quarter inch and fit comfortably on the ears. This 1970s Aztec Mayan inspired 14 karat yellow brush gold turtle measures one and a half inches by one inch and is identical to the one on the Trujillo perfume bottle coming up next. Currently, a large Lucite replica of this bottle is being sold on eBay for $400, which was once a display model in the fragrance department of a high-end department store.
This concludes a second look at my Pauline Chadura Vintage Jewelry Collection. I hope you enjoyed it. And if so, please give it a like and don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe for more fabulous videos. And until next time, wherever you are in the world, be good to yourself and to others.